Three Monmouth College students had their summer down to a science. Yeah, they were part of a world-class experiment happening at Batavia, Illinois at Fermilab. It's a national physics laboratory looking for evidence of new particles through a variety of experiments. Haley Bigelhoff takes us to the research facility to see how these experiments could change the world and the future of these three students. Bronte Deswatt may have spent her summer running the numbers. It doesn't get boring. But she knows that these small tasks add up. We do a lot of repair work and we have our own little production line, we like to call it. We know that these pieces are vital to making the tracker work. Deswatt and her two classmates at Monmouth College, Lizzie and Gianna, are part of the muon to electron experiment. It takes place at this 6,800 acre Fermilab facility. While our end goal is to discover this physics beyond the standard model that really excites scientists because it will open up a whole new area of research to find what the universe is made of. If you've never heard of muons, the muon is the heavier cousin of the electron. And if that's still too scientific, we're all just trying to understand those little building blocks of nature better. Brendan Keyberg is a scientist at the laboratory. He's a project's division head and in search of a rare process. We're looking for the spontaneous conversion of this particle called the muon into an electron. Typically that conversion needs other subatomic particles, but the team's trying to prove that it might not always. We're interested in this because the decay would signal new physics that we haven't seen before. The three young women spending their summer testing pieces. We just line it up repairing them and running software. It's been an impactful experience for now senior Lizzie Durfee. It's really surreal thinking that like we're a part of something so big, again, being from like a small school. Across campus in another building is where all these pieces are gonna be put together. Now this giant magnet is custom made for this experiment and got here about a month ago. Now in about a year, that's when all these pieces are gonna come together and they're gonna be able to run the first tests of this experiment. It's really nice to see here real world experience. And kind of like those subatomic particles, all three women using this summer as a building block for their future. Definitely opened my eyes to like the physics world and uh, just the possibilities, which are endless, I found out. In Batavia, Haley Bicklehop, WQAD News 8. Now, Fermilab is one of 17 Department of Energy laboratories across the country. And Kinberg says the muon to electric electron experiment is a collaboration between research facilities across the globe. Right now, there's over 200 people working on it. That is a really cool story. Yeah, and you know what I love about this job and stories like this? I just realized, I just realized how much I don't know, yeah, first of all. So and much. how many <laughs> smart people there are out there that are just incredible. Thank goodness for that. Yeah, right? Mm-hmm.